Hey guys, RC here. Welcome back to the channel. I am actually home sick as a dog today, but going to try to get through a little bit of recording to at least use my time wisely. Since last episode, we had, uh, if you didn't see last episode, I highly recommend going back to check it out. 2 nothing defeat, and we lost on away on penalties. The penalty shootout was... I think by far the most astounding penalty shootout I have ever seen in Football Manager, ever, by anybody. So, not just my games, anybody. So, highly recommend you go check that out. Uh, we did beat uh, Krona Marais 3-1, uh, Basharov with a goal, and Kuchinski with a brace, including a penalty. We are back for the Ukrainian Cup semifinal against Dynamo Kiev today. And taking a look, uh, Dynamo Kiev is currently in fifth in the table. We're in third and chasing Shakhtar and Obalon Kiev as well. Significantly, you know, a few points ahead of us, six and seven points respectively. I am not sure. Well, it doesn't matter for this episode. I was wondering where we were in relation to the end of phase three or, you know, section three or whatever they call it. Uh, so anyway, uh, we, we had a good run in the Euro Cup. Really disappointed that we lost in that quarterfinal. Uh, we have claimed silverware early in the season in the Super Cup, and we have a shot here in the Ukrainian Cup if we can get past uh, Dynamo. So let's get into it. Team selection, I'm kind of mixing up. I have really found that all the talk about the AI really being able to come to grips with your tactics if you don't change them up is true. And so, you know, now that you, you know, we have three tactics like we've always had, I think it is going to be very beneficial to switch them up on occasion just to just to give a different look to the AI and keep the AI on their heels. If you find one that works, use it, but if you play against a, maybe a weaker opponent, maybe go with a different tactic to, you know, try to just shake things up. Really don't like using it at this stage, but, you know, you've seen kind of the run of form we've been in. We've dropped some points. The last match I played that tactic, went back to the diamond that we have used uh, in the previous season. So in this one, we're going to go with Vera up top. Uh, Robinson, our, one of our new acquisitions, will be on the left wing. Mikhailov in the, in the number 10, Carabell on the right wing, Ramachenko and Kamziak in the mid, Stoika, Radionov, Isev, and Tarasenko on the back line, and Heidenreich. Do I want to... He's playing a 6-8-9. He's playing a 6-8-2, but he's allowing one in one. I don't know, man. You know what? I'm going to take the gamble. Let's put Krav... Kravchenko on the bench, uh, in the game. Heidenreich moves to the bench. Camps is out of this one. He's back from injury. We have finally gotten a couple of players back from injury. So that is reassuring. Starting to get some of the you know guys that we're counting on. Uh, we are going to pump our fist and get to the match. Ooh, that's new. Ooh, you get the little fancy... Uh, Graphics on the telly. Oh, look at that. A cutaway shot. Oh, way to go, Sports Interactive. All right, let's get to the match. So remember, we are at the tail end of the season after this match off camera. I'm going to just double check what, and we're in red. I got to make sure who we are. <laughs> what, what color are we today? Uh, demand more. I'm going to check and see where we are in relation to that Tier 3, Tier 4 breakout. Um, and then determine when we're going to come back. I'm thinking it's only going to be one or two episodes. Two at the most. A nice ball in. Tarasenko. And another block. Kamziak into a defender's legs. 
And we have come to expect that. Uh, he went across the face. But Tomasenko, another shot into a defender's legs. I don't get it. Uh, good header clearance, and they are on a counter. Beat Stoika. And a poor shot. Poor shot effort there. Did pick up that early yellow card, Rama, Ramanenko. Play it all the way back. If you hear my boys in the background, they're getting uh, Christmas and holiday decorations down from the attic. We don't have basements here. I know uh, a lot of places around the world, they have basements. Um, I don't know. I'd like to see a line shot there. He might have been standing over the line. But, uh, yeah, we're, we're too close. Uh, the water table's only down, a, you know, a few inches here. Uh, we're, we're right along the Gulf Coast, Gulf of Mexico, which opens up to the Atlantic Ocean. So we're only a few inches above the water table, and you can't build basements here. There's nothing to build a basement into. Everything has to be built above, above ground. So all of our storage that you would normally put into a basement. We have an attic, which is basically just an elevated basement uh, above the, you know, underneath the roof line and above your living area. So you probably knew that. They pick up an injury. Oh, there's a header. Oh, come on. Let's encourage them. All right. Pump most of them up. We've got seven shots, but only two on target here in the first half. But we're doing well. Uh, let's uh, point the finger. We've been the better team here. And let's demand more. Oh, that was a definitively poor pass by Kamziuk. And that one gets buried by Adama Bozelay. Bazelay. I guess that's a, a Bazelay. That's horrible. All right, we're going to go about 10 more minutes. If we don't start seeing anything positive. Oh, good save. Very good save. All right, you know what? I am going to hop in here. So do I want, I think I'm going to pop back here. So we're going to bring McCaleb up top. Robinson, he's okay there. Carabella's okay there. Kamziuk. Let's bring Izev up. No, we don't want to do that. Let's see. Delesha. I'm going to bring Makarov on. And... I don't have anybody that can come on for him, really. Let's bring on, you know what? I'm going to bring Delesha on, but then we're going to drop my Caleb back into that spot. Delesha's more a true striker. McCaleb can play central mid. He can play attacking mid center. So, yep, let's go with that. All right, setting up a corner. Looks like they're doing a delay tactic, or we aren't going to see the highlight. That works as well. Oh, well, that's cleared, but it's right to Radinov. We keep it up in the attacking end, so that's positive. Oh, good movement to get it back inside. A good drop pass. Takes a shot. It bounces off the woodwork and it's cleared away. All right, so at least we've had a good chance. All right, another corner opportunity. Robinson into the box. There's a header that just goes missing. Oh, that was... Let's encourage him. 
All right, Robinson. We've got a counter opportunity. They've got a lot of players back. Oh, look at the touch passing. And Carabella cannot find the near post. Oh, that was a brilliant buildup. And here's a big counter for them. We've got a few defenders back. Oh, I think that was our chance, fellas. I think that might have been our chance. Oh, that was really lucky on our part. I cannot give that shout yet. Come on, boys. All right. Stoika, Robinson. We've got so many attackers up here. I'm going to change him to support. Maybe. Yeah, let's do that. Because he is good at passing as well. Maybe that opens up some more opportunities for him. We've already made two subs. I'm thinking Stoika or Yarmolenko. Get some fresh legs over here. Maybe that'll build, do something in our build-up. Oh, no. There's a ping. We're going to go up to attacking. Two minutes of stoppage time. Arabella wants to come off in the final two minutes of the match. I'm thinking that's not going to happen. And there's the whistle. And we have dropped two cup matches in a row. We actually had the XG advantage. Not by much, but I think what hurt us in this one was only 4 of 12 on target. If we could have been, you know, 70% of that with 7 or 8, 9 on target. I think we get a goal. So, I don't know. Very disappointed. Um, I'm going to point the finger. Not happy with your performance. Yep, I'm going to go against the assistant there. But we are eliminated from yet another cup run. Wow. So, we were only expecting the quarterfinal so we made it to the semis so we're good there we were really good there we were pretty good there because they didn't want to be how do you win it and not want to be outclassed and only be at 69 percent don't know all right well so that just leaves the league a little bit of a bitter taste in my mouth i'm gonna I'm going to say that we're just going to come back for the season finale and be done. Now, the other alternative is, as I'm playing, six matches. If somehow, miraculously, we've got a shot at automatic promotion, we'll come back for that. If we are not, let's check something. Let's check something. Rules. There's nowhere to get promoted to. Okay. So, yeah. Never mind. Never mind. So, I'm looking at this. Historically, you would see the colorization and you go, okay, that's automatic promotion and playoffs. We don't have playoffs because we're the top league. All this is is Champions League qualifying or Europa. So. If we have a shot at a top two finish, which put us in, puts us in Champions League, we'll come back for that match. Otherwise, we'll just come back for the season finale and move on to next year. So that's what we'll do. Had to look at the rules to figure some of this out. Uh, also, real quick, you guys know I like to do this. Uh, we got another new subscriber. 
By the way, if any of you guys at now or any time in the near future play Cyberpunk 2077, let me know in the comments what you, you know somewhere what you think about it. I'm reading some mixed reviews, mostly good, but but I'm reading some negative stuff, and uh, it's been enough to keep me from downloading the game. So, uh, but let me know your thoughts. Uh, John one one seven, welcome to the channel. Uh, he just joined uh, uh, last night. Uh, after I recorded yesterday, uh, the episodes that went up yesterday and the day before. So uh, welcome to the channel. Uh, we'll finish out this season, and then we will keep on keeping on. Oh, that's right. That's who I played. Uh, they knocked us out, and I don't, I don't talk about that team. <laughs> I was like, I don't remember playing them because I wipe it from my memory bank. All right, guys. Well, have a good one. Hit that like button, subscribe, and all that other good stuff. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you next episode. Take care. Bye.